chips is here. Buy your plantain chips. Plantain. Good morning. Good morning. How much? Hey. Hey, we have 15 naira now, 100 naira own. Okay, give me 100 naira too. I'll buy for you soon. Uh, Okay, you are eating it here? Yeah, thank you. Thank you, sir. What is it? What? It's you! My what? It's your mother, she's dying! Yes, she's dying! Mother. We don't want to wait for the people of Plante! Hey! Mama! Hey. Government hospital. Yes, yes, yes. Please go and get me your father. Keke, Keke is better. Keke, Keke is better. Okay, 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 okay. Mama, please, you'll be fine. Wait, let me help you up. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh. Mama, can you stand up, please? Stand up for me. Oh, Nene is getting. Nene, please get the Kiki. Mama, stand up, okay? I'll take you to the hospital. Nothing will happen to you. Yeah? <laughs> Mama, please, please. Mama, please, I know you're losing strength. Please try. Try, please. Doctor, is my mother going to be okay? Oh, don't talk to me now, please. Is she going to be fine? Just take care of this. Let me see you outside. Okay. Oh, let's go. Doctor, you still haven't answered my question. How is my mother? From the test results, your mother is suffering from a rare kidney disease. It's been with her for a while now without any proper medical attention. I didn't know. I didn't know. You didn't know. You didn't get her diagnosed. I didn't have money. Hmm. At this stage, it is going to take a miracle for your mother to survive. A miracle and a lot of money. Ah! Doctor! As you see me now, you see me finish. I don't have shishi. I don't have. Except. Okay. This is it. This is 1,515 era. I made from the sales of plantain today. Please help me. Don't you have a family? A father, an uncle, or older siblings? I don't have anybody, it's just me and my mama. Please. Here. Take it all. I dash you everything. 1,500 naira. We are talking about dialysis here. Or kidney transplant. We are talking about serious money here. Not this uh, 1,500. <laughs> but uh, this is a government hospital. I thought it's free, 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 free. Free what? Free what? Free health care. Now listen to me. If you really want to save your mother, you should go and look for money. Did doctor. you hear me? Go and look for money. Doctor. I don't have time for this. I have other patients to attend doctor, to. Doctor, please don't do this to me. Please. Doctor, I beg of you. I'm sorry I can't please. be of help. Please. Please help me. Please. I have 1,005. Please. Doctor. Doctor, please. Tears 
just like my daily bread My world is crashing down Mama, I'll put this for you Here My walls are me. falling down, down, <laughs> down Down, down, down mm. You don't want water? Sorry. No. Auntie Gloria, thank you so much. Thank you so much for what you did for us at the hospital. Thank you. You're welcome, my dear. Go on, Nick. Mata, your mother, is my sister. Hmm? There was no way I was going to sit back and watch her die. Hmm? Pray for that doctor, because without him, I wonder what would have happened. Hmm? God bless the doctor. Amen. I just pray the treatment lasts longer at least. Hmm. Hmm? The doctor said the only solution is a transplant, but the cost is alarming. I don't know, I don't know where we are going to get such an amount hmm. from. God will surely make a way for us to save her. I'm just so confused. I'm so confused. You don't have to be confused. This is the time to hold on to your faith. See, nothing lasts forever. As long as you have the bread of life in you, you can overcome whatever the challenge. God in heaven will not allow your mother to die. Amen. Hey, man. Seriously, I don't know what I would have done without you. Thank you for paying the hospital bills. Thank you for everything. That is why I'm your aunt. Hmm? That is why I'm your aunt. I won't allow anything to happen to you and Mata. I'm God is in control. Hmm? Thank you. Just be strong, wouldn't you? Thank you, Mata. Hmm? Uh, let me drop the medicine. See, hmm. I'm coming. Okay, dear. Hmm. You have to be strong. Go when he needs you. I want you to fight this disease and live for us. You know, nothing will happen to you by the special grace of God. You'll be fine. Oh God. you need to know. Uh, should I get anything for you? No. Okay, then what is it? It's about your father. Yes. He's dead. No. Your father is alive. He's in this city, remarried. What? No. It is complicated. Years ago, your father Pius lost his job. And I was five months into my pregnancy. I know, suddenly, we are going to suffer. I woke up one morning. Your father was nowhere to be found. He left us. A few months later, I traced him to the city. 
I found out he has gotten married to another city businesswoman. I was sure he was not going to come back to us. I had to move. I had to come back to the village and did everything to raise you. It was tough, but we pulled through. Here we are today. I was so angry then that I wished him dead. But it seems that God doesn't answer such prayers. It's funny that I'm telling you this now. I guess I don't want to go to my grave with such secret. I don't want you to find out somewhere else. Ugawande, my precious joy, my God, my reason to live. I love you. I love you so much, my daughter. And this is your story. This is Pius, your father. And that is the gift he gave to me. When we went to the hospital and the doctor told him that I was pregnant with you. He promised to love me. He promised that our love Our love will be for eternity. He is your father. He looks like you. So he's still alive. I believe so. If I could get a glimpse of hope If I could get a glimpse of hope Things will be alright Things will be okay Oh Yeah If I could get a glimpse of hope A glimpse of hope if I could get a glimpse of Just hope Just a glimpse of hope Things will be alright Things will be okay Oh If I could get If I could get A glimpse of Just hope Just a glimpse of hope If I oh. could get A glimpse of hope this will be alright. Be okay. Hey, plantain. Plantain. Plantain girl. Hmm? You know they sell? Yeah, they sell though. How much? Uh, 15 naira. 100 naira. Okay. Um, put five for me here. Okay. Yes.
Have fun driving around. Okay. This one, your face is like this. You don't see the matter? No, sir, I'm fine. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, don't worry about the change. Keep it. Hey, thank you so much, sir. It's okay. God bless you. And you too. Yeah. God bless you. Uh, I hear my own. Thank you, sir. Take care. is like my daily bread My world is crashing down My walls are falling down 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 I'm just a shadow of myself Money and my planting chips. They ran away with it. They took your money. Mm. It's okay. Stop crying. Wipe your tears. I believe God will make a way for us. Mm? What are we going to do now? Calm down. Don't worry. God will make a way for us. Stop crying. I couldn't stop them. My daughter, what is it? Are you okay? Yes, all is well. It's all about your father, isn't it? I still find it hard to believe. My daughter, you have to believe. Mama, I appreciate you for everything you've done. I seriously do. But. I have to find him. Mama, he, he can be of help to us. To you, most importantly. My daughter, your father abandoned us. Mama, but we have no choice. We don't have a choice. 
My daughter, your father doesn't deserve you. What if we had died years ago? But here we are today, stuck in poverty. Mama, we don't have anything. Not even modern remedies. Mama, you are sick. I dropped out of school. I sell plantain. We don't have friends. Not an uncle. Just Auntie Gloria. Mama, listen. I cannot sit here and watch you die slowly. No, it's not possible. You can't find him. I can. I have something. You gave me his picture. I have the necklace. I'll ask around. I'll go to the city and find him. I'm sure, Mama. Please, you cannot die here. Please. It's okay, my daughter. If that will make you happy, you have my blessings. I will go to Auntie Gloria's house. I stay with her while you search for your father. Thank you, Mama. If you must go then, you need more than just a picture and a necklace to search for your father. I'm ready. I know. I know you are ready, my daughter. Just listen to me. I know where your father is. You do? Excuse me. Eh? What's up? I'm sorry. Sorry for what? My dear, if my bed, you come here, come back. Just carry your bag, they go make attend to better customers. Mm -hmm. I said I'm sorry, please hear me. What is it? Eh? What is it, that, madam? Eh, please. What's it happen, madam? I'm looking for this man. Ah. I I don't know him, but this. This man resembles Olga Pius. Yes, his name is Pius Uzodima. Eh? Hey, not too resemble you. Yes, it's complicated. Anyway, he's not around, but he's the director of this place. He owns this place? No, no, no. His wife owns this place. Uh, please, where can I find him? Olga Pius is not around. Uh, but from the resemblance, I think, I think it's a family problem. Anyway, you can just sit down here and wait for him. He's coming back. Huh? Okay, thank you.
Madam. Madam. Oh yeah, wake up, wake up. Uh -huh. What's him there your name? Ugoani. Okay, oh yeah, follow me. Your papers don't come. Mm. Who said is he? Carry your bag, come, follow me. She has been waiting for you. Waiting for me? Yeah. Pius. Who are you? I'm your daughter. From the village. What can be possible? What are you talking about? My mother said you gave this to her the day the doctor confirmed her pregnant with me. This is you and her. Who is your mother? What is your name? Ugoane. Mata and I agreed to name our first child that. Oh, my, my daughter. Hey, it's true. It's true. Hey. Honey, I want you to understand. Please. She's my daughter. I can't send her away. I abandoned her when her mother was pregnant with her. I can't afford to do that a second time. It won't be good. Please understand me. How is that my fault? No, you answer me. Huh? Did I ask you to abandon your wife? No, did mm -mm, answer me. Did I? So how is it my business? How? For my sake, please, let her stay. Oh? She is a total stranger. And I don't want a stranger under my roof. Darling, she is not a stranger. She's my child. I gave birth to her. Yes. Really? You didn't know she existed until a few hours ago. And suddenly she is your child. How sure are you? How sure are you? Honey, I am sure. I am very sure she's my daughter. Okay. For the sake of love. For the love you have for me. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Don't even go there. Don't provoke me. You know you and I are no longer on that love table. You ruined it the moment you lost your job. And decided to wallow in poverty for the rest of your miserable life. Oh. Oh, the worst part is I allowed you to drag me into your mess. Please, Hayos. calm down. Bring down your voice, oh? Bring down, in my own house. So, how long have you been standing there? How long have you been standing there? I'm sorry, ma. I did not mean to cause trouble. It's just that my mother is dying. She has kidney problem. The doctor said a huge sum of Money is needed before the transplants can be conducted. I came to the city to find my father to see if he can help. Oh, mom. Now you have found him. He is poor and miserable. So, my dear, there is no help. There is no help anywhere. Clara, in God's name, I beg you. I'm certain there's a way around this. Hmm? It's somebody's life we're talking about. Whose life? Is it my life? If you cared so much, you wouldn't have abandoned her in the first place. Pious. Hmm? Pious. Hmm? Remember, you have no money. No job. 
So before you make any stupid, irrational decision, chair, think it through. I've said my bits. This place reeks of poverty. Excuse me. Let you not be long. Um, I will take you to the visitor's room. You will give me some time so that I can rally around and raise some money for you, okay? As soon as possible, you will go back to your mother. Did you hear me? Why did you leave? You knew full well that Mama would suffer in your absence, yet you left. You abandoned us. Why? You did not consider the fact that Mama was with child. She was carrying me in her womb. A child both of you made with love. Me! Your own flesh and blood. You left. You left us to die. Kumane, if I begin to explain my reason for leaving, you will not understand. Your mother's health is of importance at the moment. Okay, let's sort that out. Let me take you to the visitor's room. When is she leaving? What did you say? I said, when is she leaving? Oh. Um, I want her to stay until the end of the month. Are you a comedian? You want her to stay where? In my house? Well, if she must stay, she must be useful. She'll help out with all the chores. That's a good idea. She will do whatever you want her to do. Settled then. Your daughter can stay. Oh. Thank you, dear. Who's your dear? Please! What is the meaning of that? Where are you going? I thought you came out from the bathroom. Why do you still stink like this? Please get out of my sight. Buy us leave my room. Get out of my room. How can a grown adult be smelling like this for heaven's sakes? Eh? Ron? How are you? Good morning, Papa. <laughs> Good morning. Ah, this your face is still like this. I want you to brighten up. Um, listen. There is no cause for alarm. Hmm? All is well. I've managed to convince Clara. And she has agreed that you will stay. Just that she gave some conditions. That you will have to engage in certain chores. Hmm? I don't have a problem with that. Okay? Uh, I also want you to exercise a little patience. Hmm? Everything will be all right. By the end of the month, I will raise some money for your mother's treatment. And then both of us can go to the village to see her. Oh? Nothing will happen to her. Trust me. Huh? Brighten up. Eh? Village girl! Village rats! Did you hear me calling you? Do you have ear problems or what? I'm sorry, ma. Clara, her name is Ugowane, not village. My friend, will you shut up? So you, you want to tell me what to call her in my own house? Eh? I'm sorry, dear. I have told you to stop calling me dear. Stop calling me dear, I am not your dear. You get up. Muga, 
the dishes in the kitchen, do everything, wash everything, pot plate, everything, clean. Then you go outside, the laundry basket is full, there's detergent inside. Wash everything, clean. I want everything sparkling. Am I clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, what? Yes, madam. Good. Rubbish. Are you still sitting there? Ah, where did you get, get going? The shadow of myself I have nobody My walls are falling down, down, down Down, 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 down I am dying In my emotions My heart is it's like I'm drowning deep inside the ocean. food mess up my house and do nothing about it no no ma i'm still talking you're you, 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 you still sitting down there jesus oh, 
sorry. Jose, I'm sorry. I, I've, I've been working since morning and I decided to rest. I want to, I want, can't I rest more? You've been working since morning? Yeah. Meaning that I'm suffering you. You dare open your filthy village, take him out to imply that I am stressing you out. No, no, ma, I did not mean it that way. You did not? No. If you open your mouth one more time, I will break every bone in your body. Rubbish. What's that smell? I smell poverty. I smell village dead rats all over the place. Dead rats? Ma, I swept this place very well. I even raised this couch. I did not see anything good dead rats. I did not see anything. How would you see them? You can't see them because you are the dead rat that smells all over the place. Everything about you is repulsive. Which is why you need to clean. Keep cleaning. Continue cleaning until there is nothing left to clean. You hear me? Dirty thing. Ma. I'm sorry. Please. But can I get something to eat? Something to eat? You dare conceive the thoughts of putting your filthy village smelling dirty hands into my plate. No, no, ma. Ma, I'll use a spoon. You, you use a spoon. You use a spoon. Get back to work. Clean this place until you can see your face on the towels. Sparkling, dirty smelling goods. My world is crashing down My walls are falling down, down, down Down, down, down I'm just a shadow of myself I have nobody My walls are falling down, 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 down. Village girl. Village rats. Go and get me a bottle of wine from the fridge. Yes, You smell. Honey, welcome. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Good afternoon. It seems we are celebrating something. Well, I decided to celebrate my birthday again. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. This is um, new organic skin glow cream I got. I've been using it and it's making me look and feel young again, way younger. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> so I decided to commemorate it with a fist. Interesting. I'm 19 again. Yes. Yes. You look it. <laughs> Let me join you then. Oh. What are you doing there? Come to the table. Whose table? Our table. What is our table? If you know what is good for you, warn your village champion of a daughter never to come anywhere near my dining table. Please. Honey, there is no how we can finish all of this. Really? Whatever is left, I'll give it to the dogs. Oh, don't say that. 
Okay. Dish out mine, let me eat with my daughter. Look at this one. You were never going to partake in the feast in the first place. There's beans in the pots. You can warm it or eat it like that. Please, don't stress me. That's the leftover from yesterday. It must have gone sour by now. Huh? How do you intend raising money for my mother's treatment? Her health is worsening by the day. I don't want anything to happen to her. She's the only one I have in this world. Ogoni, okay, I understand how you feel. Nothing is going to happen to her, I assure you. By the end of the month, I will be paid my salary. Hmm? I will not be needing the money, so I will give it to you. There is a little amount of money I've been saving to open a shop for myself. I will give it to you. At least it will go a long way to ensure that she undergoes dialysis for some time before we raise enough money for a transplant. You know the procedure is quite expensive. Hmm? There is nothing I do for your mother that will atone what I did to her. I mean, abandoning her when she was pregnant. You left your pregnant wife for all of this? There was nothing I could do. Eh? I couldn't afford anything. Eh? I couldn't give her food. I had to leave. I left in search of a good life. Do you think you are better now? Do you think you are the best, Papa? You are nothing compared to me now. You are stuck in this house, slaving away at the mercy of a woman who cares about nothing. You made a very big mistake. Yes, if you don't know it now, you made a big mistake. I don't want to hear it. I'm finished. Hello, Mama. Hello. Ugo Mane, you finally called. I was worried. I went to Auntie Glory's house so we can discuss this issue. Mama, my father is suffering here. His wife is very wicked, heartless and cruel. She doesn't give anybody food though. And she makes me do hard labor. All in the of is her house is her house. I thought they were happily married. I was told he has a big restaurant. No. She's very wicked. My father has nothing of his own. Do you want to come home? I told you, going there was a bad idea. He promised to give me money for your treatment. He promised me. It's just that I don't know if I can wait till month's end. What? What if that evil man kills you before then? Mama, I'm fine. I'm alive. Have you forgotten the reward of perseverance? It's okay, my daughter. But please, you have to be careful. You are all I have. Oh, because mom. Mama, I'm fine. It's better I try than not to have tried at all. It's okay, my daughter. The God I serve will guide and protect you. He will guide you even in the darkest day. He will provide for you. He will make a way for you where there seems to be no way. Amen. Hope you've been taking your medications. Yes, I am. Are you getting enough rest? <sighs> My daughter, how can I get enough rest when I know you are not here with me? Mama, you have to try. Good rest has a long way to go in your recovery. You know, right? 
It's okay, my daughter. Bow your head. Let us pray together. Let me sing praises first. Abogebue china ba wana dunile. Oke mangune si ya. Iba baraketi wo pujuru na ya. Ezendeze okwagi bebe kodi kokuli emerarea. Chine de babu bando. Ahogim chidi kagile. Odi gugwa buna kana pogi bupu na hagiezem. Ikwe si rekele mu nam kambuli hagenu. In Jesus name. Village girl. Where is that village girl? Village girl. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? I'm on a call. Hey, it's the F country for me. Hello? You're on a call. Oh, you're obviously talking to one of your boyfriends. Your useless boyfriend, okay? Boyfriend? How, the, how can you say that now? My mother did not treat me that way. I don't have any boyfriend now. Ibo, you're opening your mouth to talk to me. You're talking to me in my house. This is how we kill it here. What is going on? Mara, what is it again? What is it? Can't I have rest in my... Are you mad? Hey, what? Sorry. Hey! It was a slip of the tongue. Pius! Huh? Pius! You didn't lay your hands on me! I'm sorry. Eh? I'm sorry. You didn't lay your... Lay down! I said, lay down! Okay! What? Two of you are conspiring against me! You are going up against I'm me! Sorry. Let me see how you eat in this house! You, 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 let what me see how you eat in this house! Go on, what is it now? I didn't use my smile like father, like daughter. My child is in pain. Father, protect my child for me. Sunshine. What what is going on? Why is everywhere empty? Madam, there were customers earlier today. There were customers. So why are more people not coming? What is going on? Madam, may if you ask me, I'll say it's because of that new restaurant they opened down the street. It's not as if their food is better than our own. Ours is better. But it's just that they have fine, fine, pretty girls working there as waitresses. I don't understand. Madam, seriously, you know what these customers say? They like fine, fine girls. Besides, I need helping hands here. So that is now the strategy to sell horrible food. It's not like my food is not tasty. What are they even saying? Fine, fine girls. Sunshine is right. Oh, she has a point. I know what to do. This Pius' daughter is a very fine girl. It is time to use her. I mean, I can't be giving her roof over her head for nothing. She has to work for it. Mm -hmm. Besides, I'm paying her and I'm helping her and her useless father. Oh, Welcome. Mm. Where is your daughter? Ma. Why is this girl? Ma. Ma, good afternoon. Take this. I bought this clothes for you. Wear this particular one. This one. Yes, wear it. 
But you brought clothes for me. My friend, go and wear it. Let me see how it looks on you. Thank you. Hurry up, Paul. Mm. Darling, I hope there's no problem. There's no problem. It's just a little upgrade. Ah. You mean there's no problem? I have said it. There is no problem. Wow. Look at you. You look so beautiful. Ah, this is your hair. Ingo, give me just a minute. What's the meaning of this? I don't know. Mm hmm. Hold, hold, hold this for me. Hold the front for me. Mm hmm. Good. By the time I apply a little makeup on you, you look outstanding. Madam, I don't like this clothes. My friend, will you shut up? Madam, I don't like. Oh, you are such an ingrate! Ungrateful thing! Listen to me. Henceforth, you wear this, and you'll be working at my restaurant. You hear me? Oh, all you want to do is sit in my house, eat my food, and not contribute anything. Right? Darling. Please don't be offended. I don't want my daughter to be subjected to this kind of thing. There is nothing wrong in her working at the restaurant. It's fine. I'm okay with that. But her dressing like this is totally unacceptable. That is my problem with you, Bios. This is a business strategy. It will help boost our sales and you're telling me, tell it, telling me what? You want to introduce an innocent girl to prostitution? Prost eh? Why is it that at the slightest of opportunity you want to ridicule me? You want to make me feel that I am not a man? Have I not been trying? Have I not been doing my best? Your best. Your best is poverty, Pius. That is your best. Listen to me. Your daughter will wear this and she will work at my restaurant whether you want it or not. Else, I will leave. And I'll sell off everything. I will make sure I drown that business. By the time you and your precious daughter sleep under the bridge a few nights, you will understand. This your brain will reset. You will know that it's, it's paramount to hustle. It's paramount to strategize. This is a strategy. Honey, I'm sorry. I'll do it. Huh?
sir. We are doing, we are balancing accounts. So, uh, I'm here to collect your bill. Your bill is 7,800. You know, I, I don't know why your madam did not teach you how to address the customer of my type. Before you talk about money with people like me, you come closer. Oh, closer. Please, don't touch me again. Please give me the money, let me go. And that is the same thing we are saying. Money talks does not just go like that. You will try to come closer like that. Like. You are mad. Don't you ever touch me again. Oh, go on there. You slapped oh, me? Oh, go on there. Hey! Hey, oh, go on there. What did you do? Are you okay? I cannot see myself. My family, shut up! She slapped me! Hey! I'm sorry. I mean, your girl slapped me. Hi. Oh, do good doings! Please. It's okay. Hey, hey, hey. Somebody that comes here every day to spend money. I'm so sorry, sir. Or do good doings. I'm so sorry. The only man that can successfully buy Paris and China at the same time. Hey, Odugu, please. She slapped me. Hey, I'm on sorry. On the edge. I'm sorry. Lay her hand on me. Oh, my heart, my heart. What is wrong with you? Please, I'm sorry. See, I want this girl sacked. I will look into it. She must be behind us. Look at this one. I will look into hey, it. A bitch like this. Uh, stop. I will take that from you. You can call her any other thing, but don't call her that again. What is wrong with you? Yeah. Are you taking sides with her? Are you taking sides with her? Okay, okay. A little girl like this okay. slapped me. Oga, okay. please, shut up. Do you know why? I huh? said you should just shut up and leave this restaurant. I, I will call the police for you. Shut up and leave this place. Please. Do you know me? I, I should leave this place. Oga, okay, I don't care to know who you are. Leave this place. Ah. Hey, hey! Mba, no, don't talk to me! Mba, mba, mba. Don't talk to me! So I will come here and spend my money. Spend my dollars in your bag. Oh, guys, leave this restaurant. Slap this me. place. And your next man will spend your money. No problem. Go, go, just leave this place. Oh, don't go. There's no problem. Oh, he has not paid, though. Someone get to me. Pay us. Pay us. Look, what, what is wrong what with you? What have you done? He disrespected my daughter. Have you forgotten that customers are always right? Have you forgotten? Eh? My daughter, <gasps> you don't know what he did to me. He was touching me all over. What? My friend, will you shut up? Touching you all over. Do you know how many people Odogu has touched in his life? How many women? That you think you're, 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 you're special? You should saying. consider yourself privileged that he found you attractive to even talk, touch this dirty body of yours. Look at what you're saying. Eh? Look at what you're saying. What am I saying? I'm the only one who has the mind to, to do whatever it takes to put food on the table and feed you both. And you're here chasing my customer away. I don't want this to ever repeat itself again. And you look for my money. Look for my money. Rubbish. Get out of my sight. Listen to me. Starting from tomorrow, you must not wear all this skimpy nonsense to this place. Inugo. Nonsense. Look for Baron. Let me put on whose name. You will collect that money, whether you like it or yes. I kept it here. Okay, Mama. I'll try. But please, don't forget to take your drugs. Please don't forget. Oh, I know. Mama, you will take them from me, right? Okay. Aki, what are you doing here? Mm -hmm. Eh? Cool. Let, let me have it. You are even still whispering. If it's prostitution over the phone, you can do that very well. But in real life, you'll be pretending like one church girl who doesn't know how to do anything evil. Eh? I was talking to my mother. No, 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 no. It doesn't look like I care. If I ever see this food with you again, you 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 hear from me. Mama, friend, get go go in and go and clean. Go on, 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 uh, 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 do that stuff. Hey, where's your madam? Um, oh, oh God, Madam Clara, Sir, wait. I'm here. Where's your husband? She, he, he went to the market to buy something. You know what today is? Today? Today is the day you pay up your debt. Hi, Oga. Don't call me Oga. I'm still a young man. I am not your father. Uh, um, Osaka, please. Now me be the only fine boy money lender for this cabin. Go, go, not too worse. It is not easy. Um, My money. 
It's just small time. That's all I'm asking. That I'm asking for Biko. There she goes. Just again. give me boys, small time. Oh, do your hey, work. no, no, Look no. everywhere. No, boys. Oh, oh God, Osaka. Look okay, everywhere. Oh, God, Osaka, don't chase me out of business. Do your work. Osaka, don't do this to me. If you had paid me my money, I wouldn't be doing this. Hey. Huh? But you know me, you know I would have paid you this money. It's just that a uh, man down there who opened a new restaurant. He's taking my customers. Send her down the street. Huh? He's also my customer. I can't wait to be done from here so I can go there. I intend season his less just cheap because I know it will look good in my garage. He's on you too. Hey. Look everywhere! Hey! Oh God, Saka, please! Look everywhere! Don't do this to me! Have you forgotten how far we have come? Don't do it, remember? I don't used to owe you like this! Please forgive my madam. I don't know what she must have done, but please forgive her. I beg you. I didn't do anything. Stop! Stop! Stop. Uh, boys, um, you can go. Hey! Hey! Yes, you, you can say go. Say you can go. Me. Go! Hey! Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank Osaka, you. thank you. Go. Thank you very much. God bless you. Just a small time. I will settle everything. God bless you. Thank you so Who much. Is that girl? Eh? That one? Eh, eh, she's my stepdaughter. You didn't tell me you have a beautiful stepdaughter. <laughs> eh, eh, eh. You, you, you like her? Who wouldn't? I need to get somewhere, but... I will come back so we will discuss about her. Okay? That's if you don't mind. Hey, I don't mind though. I don't mind at all. Whenever you come back, you can have her. Oh. Okay, I uh, I will see you later. Okay. Thank you very much, Ogasaka. Just small time, I will clear everything. Yeah? Mm. Have a nice day. Mm. Bye bye. How do I raise two million naira? How? Eh? Did I hear you say two million? It's actually three million naira! Hey! I know Sakai is a very ruthless man when it comes to money. I regret borrowing from him. I regret it. It's his money. That is what he does for a living. Our only regret is allowing you invest half of the loan into your stupid Ponzi. No, 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 no. Allowing us to incur this eternal debt. I've been apologizing. I'm sorry. I don't need your apology. We should be thinking of a solution. We should be thinking of a solution. Hi. You know, raising three million naira in one week is not possible. No magic can, can guarantee that. Unless... Unless what? Um, I think your daughter Ugomane has captured Osaka's attention. Honey, please, don't go there. My daughter is barely 18, okay? Besides, I will not use her to pay off a debt. You are so stale-minded, Pius. You, you don't need to use her. You don't need to force her. All we need to do is arrange a meeting between both of them. And before you know it, they will fall for each other. And if things goes well, your daughter will be married to a wealthy money lender. And all our problems, yum, vanish. Clara, I am not going to get my daughter involved in our transaction with Osaka. But she's our only option. You better man up and do what needs to be done. Or watch our business being taken by that man. Have, uh, have you thought about what he, he will do to her? You know he's a wicked man. What if he touches her? I wouldn't sell off my daughter into slavery just because we I We have to no pay. other option, Pius. But that is our only option. What are you saying? Clara, calm down. Eh? Must you always yell at me whenever you want to drive home a point? What kind of thing is this? I'm your husband. I married you. You stopped being my husband the day you lost your guts. Um, have you heard from Ugumane? Hmm? No. I haven't heard from her since five days now. And I am getting worried. Don't worry. Hmm? Don't worry. God will not allow anything to happen to her. Hmm? Just calm down and free your mind of worries. You know, go. She will call. You know? 
I pray so. She will. Nothing will happen to her. You just pray so. Let me, let me give you your medicine, you know? Let's take, I'm gonna take this one first. Later in the evening, you will take more. Madam Clara. Osaka, Osaka, my main man. Hey, welcome. Thank you. How is business? Business is fine, no. Oh. We're just pushing it. Okay, Osaka, please come and sit down. Come and sit down. Madam Clara. Osaka, my man. Hey. Welcome, ma. Uh, let me get you your special. I will arrange it very well and it will be served to you by. That's my beautiful stepdaughter, the one you like. You too correct. <laughs> Please relax, I'll be right back. Oh, All right, no Osaka. problem. Osaka. Madam Clara. Ugo Mane. Ugo. I'm Osaka, a money lender, and a close friend of your father and stepmother. I really want to get to know you a little. Thank you. You really look beautiful, and um, it would be nice if we become friends. So tell me more about yourself. Huh? Yes. Tell me about yourself. My name is Ugwane, and it's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> um, you can join me. Better still, you can tell your stepmother to get something for you. No, no. I'm fine. I'm not hungry. Are you sure? Yes. Okay. Uh, tell me, Ugo Wane, which of your parents gave you this beautiful name? <laughs> Ugo Wane is a red giant. <laughs> I know. Mm. I hope you don't mind. I would like to make her my wife. Your wife? Yes. You, Osaka. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care what people may say, but believe me, I am serious. 
She's very meek. She's modest. And she's very respectful. Mm -hmm. You did a good job by raising her. So how come I've never seen her around? Well, let's just say we didn't want to expose her to the world. Oh, you know? that's good. <laughs> <laughs> if not, I wouldn't have found her this result. Exactly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I intend coming with my father so I can make my intentions official. Ah, ah. No problem. Whenever you're ready, just let me know. Eh? I am ready now. Very much ready. Ah, ah. Osaka. Call it love at first sight, but... <laughs> Madame Clara, there is something special about this girl that I want her to be mine. <laughs> Madame Clara, this marriage, they your hand do. <laughs> mm? Please talk to Gowane and your husband to please accept my proposal. Osaka, <laughs> you have nothing to worry about. Trust me. I will make all the necessary arrangements and let you know when you can come for introduction. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, you, hey. can, you can have this. Hey, hey well, no, now I can't possibly accept this. You know, I'm still owing you. You owe who? Very soon you're going to be my in law, so you owe me absolutely nothing. Consider your debt glad. You see? <laughs> hey! Chimo! <laughs> Yes. Just like that. Just like hey, that. Hey, Osaka, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you. See, ah, this is unbelievable. But trust me, Gowane is as good as yours. Mm. Hey! I trust you can pull this off. <laughs> it is done, settled. Clara. Thank you, thank you. Hey, Uchimu. Oh. <laughs> Hey, let me get back to this mess. Right, so. right. Very well, very well. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Take hey, care of yourself, no okay. problem. Let me get back to this mess. So. <laughs> Chimo. Just to make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. Hey, this is a miracle. My husband, where would you have gotten three million naira to clear up these debts? Where? Hey. Indeed. Are you not happy? All you have to do is just make sure our daughter accepts and we'll still be getting amazing gifts like this. Smell it, smell it. Clara, <laughs> Clara, this is manipulation. Outright blackmail. This is manipulation. I don't understand. Clara, you have to understand. Eh? All I see is a pedophile. A man who wants to defile an innocent child. He doesn't love my daughter. He just wants to get her because I owe him a debt. Why do you always see the gory side of everything? Clara, I will not be a runaway father who reunites with his daughter, only to end up forcing her into a marriage. What is worse than abandoning her as a child? Eh? Listen to me, my friend. You are doing her a favor, securing a bright future for her. Osaka is our only option to save our business and eliminate poverty from our lives. It's not going to happen. My daughter is not a means to an end. Admit it or not, she is a means to an end. She's our only hope. Unless you can magically provide three million overnight. Prepare. Force her to accept that marriage. It's not going to happen. What am I? It's not going to happen. Ugo, one name. Yeah, Ugo! Madam. Um, please, sit down, my dear. Um, you remember that man, Osaka? Osaka now? Yeah, yes, yes, yes. You remember him? Mm. Good. Mm. He says he wants to marry you. <laughs> and your father and I have accepted that you marry him. Madam, I cannot marry him. Oh. Madam, you have to marry him. Oh. You know why? Because we need to settle our debt of 3 million naira. If you don't, your father will lose his job at my restaurant. And you end up sleeping under the bridge. Is that what you want? Don't worry. Osaka will come with his people in a few days' time. You still have until then to make up your mind and say yes. Hey, Madam, please. I want to go to school. I want to take care of my mother. I don't want to marry now. Please. 
As far as I'm concerned, you're already married to him. All you need to do is prepare for the marital task ahead. No, no. Please get no. up. No, get no, up. I'm, Martha, trying get up. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm trying to help you here. You're telling me what, what, what are you saying? I'm trying to give you a bright future. Yeah, 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 yeah. To marry now. My love, please don't. Talk to your daughter. Don't make me get married. Please. Papa, what is this now? Why did you accept to marry me off? I did not accept. The shadow of myself I have nobody My walls are falling A possible expansion to all this. I just need you all to be calm. Enjoy the drinks and the food. Those are tears of joy. You know, let me just go and talk to her. Oh, Pikon. What is the meaning of this? Ugo, my name. Ugo. Young Wokem, what was the meaning of that rubbish? Eh? Am I not talking to a human being? What was the meaning of that rubbish? Uh, what do you want me to say? Am I Ugo Wanne? I warned you. I told you not to push that girl into an early marriage. You refused. Who is talking about Ugo Wanne? Ugo Wanne who is comfortably going to her husband's house as we speak. I'm not talking about that. You know exactly what I'm talking about. What was that dirty attitude you had, you had on your face? She was looking at you, that was why she displayed that nonsense. Eh? Why were you doing your face like that? What kind of thing is this? Clara, you like trouble a lot. I've been married to you for so many years now. You know that's how I keep my face whenever I'm happy. You know. I reject your poverty. I reject it. Just count yourself lucky that that stupid mannerism of yours did not ruin this whole plan. You would have seen the other side of me. Rubbish. That is how my face is. Nonsense. Be a man for once you can't. This is our new home. Yes, I bought it so we can build this marriage in comfort. Don't you like it? It's very big, warm and cozy. This is not what I want for myself. I want to go to school. This is an early marriage for me. I did not plan this for myself. 
I promised myself that I would go to school and be educated. I am sorry. I really am. If you want to go, there's no problem. But I want you to know that I really love you. I will do anything you ask of me. I will send you to the best school because I want you to be a better person for me. I will let you settle if you need anything. Parish is there to assist you. Oh yeah, madam. I may be Parish, you know me, say, or God don't tell you send me for outside. If you need anything, come to my cranny and uh, noobs, anything. Nami go cook for washing. For, in fact, sometimes when television off, Nami go on now. Your work and I just comfortable yourself, I do for you, ma. <laughs> yes, uh, Parish is an auxiliary worker. He's everywhere. He can help you everywhere. He can help you. Parish, yes, go back to your duty post. Greetings, sir. Let me take you in. You like it, eh? I really like you. That is why I want this to work. I know you are afraid and insecure, but believe me, all the promises I made to you, I'm going to fulfill all. Trust me. Not again. Surprise! <laughs> I got you a new car. Today is your birthday. Happy birthday, sweetheart. I thought I would get this car for you. <laughs> you shouldn't have. Why not? You deserve the best. Come and take it for a spin. Come. Who's 
so. You will like say something they worry, madam. You get what's in the worry. Um. I've done everything possible to make her happy, but uh, what is going on? It means say something deep where you suppose know the warrior. Because no woman will see this kind better gift. Snob and go inside. Nala. It means say she they pass through waiting, you never know. Uh. I'm so sorry things are going this way. This is not the kind of life I mapped out for myself. I want to go to school. I don't want to be a bride now. I want to go to school and get good education. All right, noted. I already gave you my word. Please, can you eat now? Please. Possibly tell me you haven't done this before. I've not. I'm still a virgin. Uh huh. Now you're mine. You're my wife. I have every right to make love to you. No. Please, sir. I cannot do. I cannot do this with you now. But you, you have to. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I don't want anything from you. I just want us to talk as husband and wife. I'm willing to wait. <sighs> it's obvious you hate me. It's not like that. Then what exactly is the problem? We just got married. I have a mother who is sick in the village. Doctor said she's suffering from kidney disease. She's the main reason I came to the city to look for my father. He abandoned us years ago, even before I was born. It was not my intention to get married now. I was just doing what my stepmom asked me to do. I have no one. Just my mother and my aunt in the village. The most disturbing part is that my stepmom got rid of my phone and I cannot even reach my mother. I don't know how she's doing. Points of correction. I am here now. I promise to help you. I want you to be happy. I want you to live your life. 
I'm going to help your sick mother and I will also make sure your dream of going to school is achieved. Just be happy, okay? Live your life. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. You're welcome. But, why me? Why did you choose me? I've been cheated in, I've been duped a lot of times. Many women want me for my money. But when we met, you didn't give me the face. I love the boldness. The other time we had a long discussion and believe me, I enjoyed every bit of that conversation. I saw innocency. I saw love. I saw compassion. I saw determination in you and that is what I want every day in my life. I need an angel, a blessing from God. I pray that someday you will love me too. Welcome back. <laughs> Welcome. Thank you. I can see you're busy. <laughs> yes. Okay, I have a surprise for you. Surprise? Yes. This is your admission letter to one of the best private universities in town. <laughs> and um, I got this phone for you. You can keep in touch with your mom. I'm sure you like it. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so happy. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. What are you doing? Nothing. I'm I just I'm just watching you sleep. I could stare at your beautiful face all night. Okay. You're making me shy. <laughs> You're not looking badly either. Mm, don't brainwash me. I'm serious. Well, if you say so. Mm. You should sleep. It's late already. All right. Mm -hmm. Do you want to stay like that? <laughs> okay. I can't wait to devour this meal my wonderful Ugawane is preparing. Good morning, <laughs> sir. Good morning, sweetheart. Why are you up so early? Making breakfast for us. You don't have to. The cook can always do this. Hmm. Don't make me look like a spoiled brat. It's my thing, so allow me. <laughs> okay, if you say so. <laughs> Also, you're a very nice man, and God bless you. And you're a very wonderful being. <laughs> I will never let you down. <laughs> <laughs> Allow me! I'm busy. Okay, I'll be waiting in the dining. Okay. All right.
a penny for your thoughts? Uh, no, I'm fine. No, you're not fine. Tell me, what is the matter? I've been thinking about life, about everything. Life hasn't been this good towards me. Good things doesn't last forever. I understand you go on there. You do? Yes. You see, Osaka, you're such a nice man. You're so hard on the outside and you're so subtle Considerate and nice behind closed doors. Ever heard of not judging a book by the cover? <laughs> You're not serious. <laughs> I really love you. You're so peaceful. I've never met a girl like you before. You're so different. And you're such a nice man. Thank you once again. And may God bless you. Mm -hmm. God bless you too. <laughs> so, what are we watching? Hey, look what we have here. August visitors of the year. Follow us. Honey. you welcome. Thank you so much. Hey. Uh -oh. Welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you so much. Go on. <laughs> you look so good. Thank you. Mm. All thanks to Osaka. He's a very nice man. Oh, oh I don't want him. Thank you. Hello. Thank you. <laughs> it's been a while. Look at how you're glittering. <laughs> I don't want to get in them. Carlos, <laughs> it's okay. Oh. You're not the center of attraction. You carry your attention seeking behind and sit down in one place. Biko. Ah, uh, um, uh, uh, Clara. There is nothing wrong in trying to know his daughter's well-being. Yes. What needs to be looked into is how you talk to people with so much spite and disrespect. Nobody wants to be insulted in public. With due respect, I will advise you change as soon as possible. Nim. My love, I'm my okay. love. It, it's okay. It's just that you know this man. He has a way of bringing out my worst side. Eh? But, but that one has passed. Biko, I'd like to see you in private. Um, let's talk some business, you know? <laughs> okay, um, sweetheart, I'll be back. Mm. Papa, <laughs> you. Hey, <laughs> um, my in law, you know, in this whole triangle, I'm your sure plug. So, you know, you will reward me handsomely. I don't understand. I made everything possible now. So what you don't what don't you understand? I still don't get it. Are we in good terms? Of course. Why will I have problem with my in-law? In-law. That is the word. <laughs> Without me, you will not be an in-law. You wouldn't have been married to that village rat. This will be the last time you will refer to my wife in such crude manner. Hey, well. Yes, I love her. And I can't stand you calling her a village rat. For what? It's okay. It's okay now. Sorry about that. Um, mm -hmm. um, I hope you still remember what we talked about. I mean, the money we talked about. The one you promised to give me for the renovation of my shop. The uh, four million naira. Mm -hmm, that one. I remember you said... Um, by the end of this week, no, the end of this month. I'm still looking forward to it. <laughs> that will no longer be possible, Madam Clara. I recently forfeited your debt of three million naira. Do you also remember that Ugomane's mother is gravely ill? She has kidney disease and she's dying. Plus my wife needs to go to school. Everything is on my head and in my scale of preference. They come first. So you're saying you will not give me the money because of her treatment? 
Besides, why would you be sending Ogomane to school? You want those useless and desperate boys to take their thorns on her. I know what she's capable of doing. She can't do such. Her business is basically fine. I think her life is more important than renovation of vanity. But you give me your word. Eh, you give me your word, Osaka. You should be considerate. That old woman needs the money more than you do. That's why we came so we can see Pius and also discuss with him about his daughter's intention to go to school. Ewo, so you came to see Pius and not me? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> yes. I'll see you later, Madame Clara. Osaka. Hey. So this wretched village rat thinks she can use me to climb a ladder of success. Ah. Pius. Nice one. Nice try. But I promise you, this will not last long. By the time I'm done with Ugomani, even the carcass will be better than her. Imagine. Ah, Osaka, you're just a big fish. It's enough pepper I will stuff in you and the vultures will enjoy. You enjoy. You useless. Hello? Rashid, I need to see you urgently. Let me know when you're ready. Oh, darling, I didn't know you're still awake. Yeah. Why did you take so long to come back? I'm sorry. I was watching a football match with friends. I didn't know when it got this late. It's fine. Hurry up and come to bed. I want you to have me tonight. <laughs> you sure you want this now? Yeah, why not? <laughs> okay, uh, let me quickly fresh up. I'll be back.
Weki weki. Good morning, my beautiful wife. Mm. Breakfast. <laughs> yes, I knew you would need it, so I went to the kitchen to prepare something nice for you. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much. I want to say thank you for everything. The love, the care you showed me. I really appreciate it. You're really a nice man, Osaka. <laughs> Very nice. Expect more, my love. Um, so, can you eat now? Yes, but oh. you have to eat with me. Okay, no problem. <laughs> hey. Ooh! <laughs> It's okay. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> this is for you. Oh, thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> My lady, you don't have to be angry. You just have to take things easy. I've heard everything you said. See, that man must go down. He must go down. He can't use it like this. You need to go down. Let me see how that dirty village girl will make it in this life. Okay, I will just call Ax and Jaffet right away. Please do. And make sure they do a clean job. I will reward them handsomely. Hey, guy, guy, listen. Beta Parodi. And the thing is, Beta Parodi. See, Mama go pay on a handsomely to get. All right now, later. Okay, later. My lady, you just have to calm down. That man, half dead. Okay? I can't wait to spit on his grave. He thinks he can make a caricature of me. Clara! Show him. It's time to come. So you show me too. <laughs> you are not free. It's an urgent business meeting I must attend. I know it came on a short notice, but I promise I'll be spending just three days and I'll be back. Okay. And um, once I get back, we'll go to the village and see your mother and bring her to the city. Yes, I had a meeting with a certain doctor and that was what he proposed. <laughs> Thank you so much, Otsaka. Thank you. You know, I want to say thank you for what you've done for me and what you're about to do for my mom. Thank you so much. You're really a nice man and I'm going to miss you so much. And I will miss you more, my beautiful wife. <laughs> um, I need to rush so I don't... I need to cut my flag. Yes. You've worn all your jewels. Yes. Let me help you. Okay. I'll take it. Okay.
God. Why is he not picking his calls? He said he was going to come back on Friday. Today is Monday. Yet, no one has heard from him. Uh, uh, Madam, not to take him to heart. I know saying as much in the goalie where they go longer. He go come back. He should have sent a text. He should have called. I've called everyone he knows. They said they've not heard from him. Everybody. Ah, if you don't call everybody and they don't know where he's in there, I'm saying if he asks me, I go suggest me we carry the matter, go meet police. That's Maybe they feel help us right now. That's, that's, that's good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, madam. Good morning. I am Officer Fred from the police headquarters. Um, and I believe that you're Mrs. Osaka. Yes. Have you heard from my husband? <sighs> well, uh, madam, I, I don't know how this may sound to you, but um, your husband was attacked by some unknown gunmen. In fact, their car was hijacked on his way to the airport. And then Along the line, he was shot. I please accept my deepest condolence. Hi! What is that? No verse now. I'm going to talk to you. I'm going to talk to you. Madam. 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 Hey! Madam. 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 Hey, go water. Please, can, can you get Madam. water? Get water. Get All water. this are helping me. Get water. Get water. Oh. Madam. Help me, hospital. Tears is like my daily bread. My world is crashing down My walls are falling down, down, down Down, down, down mm. I'm just a shadow of myself I have nobody My walls are falling down, 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 down. I am down in my emotions. Hello, Auntie Gloria. Is this you? Hi. Mr. Gloria, how have you been? My phone, my phone went bad. Yes, that was why I couldn't reach you, no, Mama. I've missed Mama so much. Are you with her? Please, let me talk to her. Huh? What happened? What? No. I am dying in my emotions. My heart is groaning. It's like I'm drowning <laughs> deep inside <laughs> the ocean. My brother sweat by killing him, Abby. You have failed. You know what? From the first day I set my eyes on you on that marriage day, I know you're up to something. I know you are a witch! A very big one for that matter. How dare you accuse me of my husband's death? Will you shut that hole you call a mouth? I want you to swear by the gods that you have no hand in our brother's death. I'll do no such thing. What? It's a guinea. Go up there. 
pack your things and leave this house because we are locking this whole house. It's our brother's house, our sweat, our own brother. Uba. I say so. What are you waiting for there? Go upstairs, pack all your things and leave the house for good. What is it? I seriously can't believe they are backwards people what? who capitalize on the demise of their hardworking sibling to eat and squander their sweat. I won't fight you people for this. Osaka will do that for me instead. Because I'm going. I'm leaving this house. What's this? 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 Don't mind. Uh -uh. Don't worry. I'll we'll get to the bottom of this matter. Uh, madam, uh, no first I know that you say now, now you they can't see. See, when I see your mood, I don't say you're not good at all. So I say, make I know tell you, no verse. Um, Parish. Ma? Thank you for everything you've done. But I'm going home. Ma? I'm no longer going to live here. Ma, you have to leave here now. In your house, now your house, now your house, get him. Where did he go make you leave? I already called a cab. I'm sure you saw him outside. A girl, one man, where enter? Yes. Uh, please, can you help me carry my bags? I'm not so strong. Oh, help me help her carry the bags. You leave this house immediately. Oh, no, I see my dad. You're not so. My boss is so. Now, see my mama. Bully her, boy, look. My mama, my mama. The pain of the house has finally left for good. Animal. <laughs> oh, I, I, can't, I can't talk. I can't work.
world is crashing down My walls are falling down, down, down Down, down, down I'm just a shadow of myself Are falling down, 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 I tried my best. I swear I did. I even borrowed money for the transplant, but she couldn't make it. Before we got to the hospital, she died on the road. Why? Why does it have to be now? It's okay. She couldn't be alive to see all the places. It's okay. It's okay. You have me, Kumande. It's okay. You have me. It's okay, my daughter. Stop crying. Stop crying. Oh, let's stop crying. You know? Where is her grave? God, it's over there, close to her mother's grave. <laughs> oh, this is a hard buried. Close to my mother's grave. <laughs> it's all my fault. I came late. I came so late. All I ever wanted was for you to be healthy. All I ever wanted was for you to smile. All I ever wanted was for us to be happy. But it's not possible anymore. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. It's okay, Hugo. I know it's okay. I'm so sorry. I think my son is so okay. I'm so sorry. I think I'm so sorry. 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 I'm so Deep inside the ocean If I could get a glimpse of hope If I could get a glimpse of hope Things will be alright Things will be okay Oh, yeah. If I could get a glimpse of hope, a glimpse of hope. If I could get a glimpse of just hope, just a glimpse of hope. Things will be alright. Gloria, okay. Pius, hmm? oh. you. What are you doing here? Gloria, please. I'm sorry. Oh, shut that thing you call mouth. Did I just hear you say you're sorry? Sorry for frustrating my sister to death? Or sorry for what? Don't talk like that, Biko. I'm sorry. Pius, 18 years. For 18 years, you left my sister to die out of frustration. I thought living will bring relief. I want my sister about a coward like you. But oh, she wouldn't listen. Now, see where her love for you has gotten us to. Gloria. You're here telling me you're sorry. I'm sorry, Bukwegi, there. Bagalo, Pico. The, the level of poverty was so much, I had to go look for money. Eh? I didn't go. It wasn't my intention to leave. Did you hear yourself? I had nothing to offer. For 18 years. It still did not change anything. Okay. You left my mother to suffer. You frustrated her so much. I know, I'm sorry. So why are you here now? 
Have you come to laugh at my sister's grave? Oh, or no. to mock me? Oh, Pico Gloria. I've come to ask for forgiveness. May the gods punish me if I intentionally caused her death. I'm sorry. I know I wronged her. I wronged all of you. I'm only asking for forgiveness. Please. Oh. Go on then. Because then. I'm sorry. Forgive your father. Forgive me. Go on. Oh, you've forgiven me? Yes. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I've forgiven you. Gloria Picosian, forgive me. Useless man. Go on. Where's our grief? Come with me. Like my daily bread, my world is crashing down. My walls are falling down, 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 down. I miss you. I miss you, Mata. Your memory will always. Your memory will always be. I'll be <laughs> when you smiled, the whole world stood still to stare. She exuded grace. She was so amazing. She was loving. She was exceptional. She loved me despite my shortcomings. I pray you find a place in your heart to forgive me in the land of the spirits. I am sorry. I am sorry for all I did. I am sorry for all the pain I caused you, Martha. I'm sorry. <laughs> I will go to any length to make you happy. Oh? Good afternoon. Uh -huh. Good afternoon. Who are you and what do you want? I am Barista Chikuma, late Mr. Sakasa Tony. Oh. Yes. What got to me that uh, three of his siblings attempted selling his mansion on the island. I got them arrested for fraud as they had a falsified deed for the property. That prompted my trip to this village. Okay. So. How did you find me? Uh, oh, um. Parish. Parish. What is he doing here? Madam, good afternoon. Oh. Nami, no verse. Nami, tell him where you come or go. 
you have a very nice gate man. Okay, thank you. So, now you're here, what's all this about? Oh, okay. Uh, I have some few documents here for you to sign so I can proceed in transferring all the assets of Ms. Osaka's to your name. Mm -hmm. You know, Ms. Osaka willed everything to you. Didn't he tell you? I don't know what you really did, but he truly loved you. I really don't know what to say right now. Just say, thank you, God. I don't want all of this. Huh? I wish he was here to do it by himself. I really miss him so much. Police. You're alive. Yes, yes. I'm alive. What happened to you? Your stepmom, Clara. She connived with her lover and ambushed the car I was going to the airport with. They shot at me. Thank God the bullet didn't get me except the scars I got when I lost control of the car. Madam Clara, Jesus, she was supposed to be your friend. She's a snake. When she found out she couldn't get anything from me, she planned to have me murdered. But I'm here. Thank God I didn't die. God said it's not my time. <clears throat> As I speak with you now, they're in the police custody awaiting trial. Okay. Uh, but why did you bequeath everything to me? Because you're my world, Ugomane. Yes, even in death, I promise to fulfill all the promises I made to you. I know how mischievous and trashy my step-siblings and kinsmen can be. That was why I willed everything to you. I love you. I love you too, Sacha. Thank you, your man. I'm here for you. Just a shadow of myself 